What's up everyone, it's DV and we're back in Roblox Bedwars and today I'm going to be doing a CTF mode of the game. I'm building, I'm a dev on the game. No, I'm kidding, I'm not a dev on the game, okay? I'm just gonna make a fake game. We're gonna make a fake Bedwars capture the flag game and yeah, this is a bad idea, but as hopefully I don't get banned, okay? Hopefully they don't ban me for this because I think they might, I, I hope they don't. But today, yeah, we're gonna be making our own CTF game. I'm gonna be showing you the entire process and we're gonna play it and it's gonna be awesome. So before I completely get banned, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already I don't think the devs are gonna like what I'm gonna be making. They're not gonna like it because I keep telling them to make capture the bed and they won't do it. So maybe this will give them a little nudge, okay? Because it's fun. It's fun. Come on. All right. So we are in Roblox Studio. We're gonna create a new game. We're gonna use the capture the flag framework because why would I build it if it's already built? Come on, like 3000 IQ, come on, let's go. So hopefully I can figure out how to use this. Okay, here we go. So over here is the blue flag and over here is the red flag. This is how it's made, okay? This is how it's done. So let's go ahead and first make a new project. We're gonna call it Bird Wars. No, we're gonna call it Bed Wars, CTF. And then we're gonna go and uncheck the phone because mobile players, you know, you gotta be on tablet. I'm not gonna mess with you mobile phone players complaining about my game. And we're gonna leave Team Create on. All right, saving. And then we got our project, it's gonna reload. It's gonna take like an hour because there's training in here hello so we got our project it's created and now we got some work to do so let's go over to this bed over here we're gonna just examine this this is the actual flag i think it's called the what is it called the flag stand and then inside here is a flag and some other stuff so let's go get our properties or workspace window don't put it there dv don't put it let's move it to the right all right so i'll check this out so we got the flag stand but we need to get a bed so let's look up a bed in the toolbox we need a bed wars bed this one might work let's see if it does i think i think we need like we need the it can't just be one part because we we got two parts for the flag. We need to get the other one. All right, there we go. This one has a script. Do you see that warning? So we need to make sure we get rid of all these scripts. Anytime you're messing with like studio, always turn off scripts. Like don't mess with that kind of stuff. In fact, when you drag it over, it might even like inject stuff. So be careful. Lots and lots of malicious scripts inside the toolbox. So let's go ahead and change this. We're going to change this part to, I think we're going to call this one the flag banner because the flag banner is kind of the thing that has color to it. And, um, but first let's go ahead and weld these legs to it so that the legs don't fall off because the legs are going to fall off. And we don't want that. We want the legs to stay there we go and one more and we kind of drag these over so we got to move these to the flag stand so let's move all these to the flag stand oop my weld constraints died so we'll have to redo the welds um we gotta we gotta get rid of this flag stand so let's go and rename these first we gotta get rid of the old flag and we gotta change this part to be called flag banner and there we go we'll just make one of these flag pole now i think this is gonna cause some issues later because i think the flag pole attaches your back but it's fine we'll leave it as is i could always add like an invisible part or something but that's nah, fine it's fine and then it looks like we're gonna have to re-weld all this stuff and let's change the color to match this blue it's like bright blue or something so let's just paste in the same color so it has to match the same color as the flag stand like it's got to be like bright blue otherwise it won't recognize it all right now we just need to drag this onto the flag stand all right let's move this back to the platform we're just going to center it here like that and i think we can move this piece down i'm not sure but i think we can just move that down i don't think it's needed it might be though we might have to revert this let's just slide it right there and then we got our bed oh we should make that transparent because we don't really need that little blue platform either let's make that transparent real quick all right so let's go and duplicate this we're gonna make the red sign now so let's go and drag this over let's get rid of the old one we need that red though it's got to match the same red there we go let's get rid of this old stand slide this over and we got to change that blue too that blue light's bright so there's the red light all right we got a red bed and then we got this platform here and then it looks like we got to fix our welds so let's go and fix all of our welds that way the legs don't fall off okay now we got to do the same over here so the legs need to get welded back and one more there we go so they're both welded i think we could we should be able to test this yeah we're good all of them are welded cool let's try test run real quick over here and hit play oh you know what it's way too long it's still 30 second timer so let's go and change that to eight seconds and that's going to reduce the start time because it takes way too long for an intermission and we're in the game look at ctf let's go run over here and get a bed i've got a rocket launcher too you can actually destroy the bridges in this game it's pretty cool You just gotta be careful not to blow up your own bridge it's like classic doomspire all right we gotta get this blue bed let's grab it there, we gotta run through it like 50 times. Why do we gotta run through it 50 times, dude? I think you have to run over the pole itself. That's probably what it is, because the it's just the leg. That's okay, we know how to fix it. I kinda like it though. It's a feature, it's not a bug, it's a feature. Remember that, it's a feature. All right, I hope this works. Man, that took that took forever to travel. All right, let's 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 try to trigger it. Oh, it's not triggering, dude. Okay, you know what, I think, I think I know why. I think it's because I lowered the platform into the ground too much. I bet that's the trigger for the flag, so let's raise this real quick. Blue too, I need to fix that. It's blue, it's the wrong color. That should be red, let's fix that color. It should be red. Okay, there we go. Red. Let's come over here. Raise this up. And I think we can get rid of these walls. I don't think we need these walls. Yeah, we don't need these. So let's go ahead and get rid of these. There we go. We only need the spawn. Delete that. And we can get rid of all these as well as the main. We don't need these main bases. There we go. Go to the editor. We'll go to region. And then we're going to select this. And we're just going to delete all of this. 
There we go. That looks good. Let's go ahead and delete. Boom. All right. We just need to do the rest now. It should be pretty quick. Delete. And one more delete. There we go. Oh, dude, you can also inside the toolbox. I just found this. Look at you can do the skybox from the Christmas event. And typically, I mean, you don't really usually have that in matches, but I, it's so cool. We might as well include it. Oh, look, at, it's the battle pass logo too in 3D. Let's try this. Where's it at? There it is. All right. So we got the battle pass. Check this out. We should make it huge. Oh, it's too small. But let's position it right there. Yeah, it's way too small. We got to make this thing way bigger. We got to make sure it's anchored first. Yeah, it's not anchored. So there it goes. And let's make this bigger after we position it. We'll just move it a little bit to the left there. Then let's make it huge. There we go. Oh, that's perfect right there. I was thinking about like using forest, but man, the snow one looks really good. See, they've got all kinds of maps in here. So there's the Bed Wars forest map. That's like a classic map, but this snow one looks really cool. I kind of want to do the snow one. So let's use that. I think it looks the freshest. Plus, you know, we, especially with the skybox. So there it is there. We just need to make sure there's no scripts. Always check for scripts. They might try to inject stuff like viruses and stuff. So no scripts. Cool, cool. That's all we have. And um, now what we need to do is we need to go in and make this a two base map because right now it's four players, like four bases. We don't need four bases. It's too big. It's too big. So let's go ahead and get rid of these. And there's no way I got to ungroup this. But let's go ahead and we'll start removing some of these. I don't know how big these pieces are. There's that. Oh, there's so many pieces here. Look at all these little slices and stuff. Look how many there are. Yeah, I gotta ungroup this. All right, it's ungrouped. Let's go ahead and just delete all this. Sweet. Now we gotta do the other side. All right, so we have our beds here. Now we need to set them up. We also have our bases. We have some bridges. Let's go ahead and get rid of these fake beds. All right, all those beds are gone. So now we just need to place our beds. Oh, let's move this first. Let's rotate it 90 degrees. There we go. Now we just need to place it a little bit closer. This should work. I think we need a way to get to these side islands. So let's just put these and we'll make these diagonal and we'll just extend this a bit. It's gonna look super ugly. I'm not spending forever on this. I'm just gonna do that. Just move these over. So that way both bases should have some diagonals. We gotta get a way out too. Now we're not gonna have any generators in here because there's no, you know, obviously you don't spend anything. We just need a way to get out of these islands just in case they blow up one of the bridges. All right, now let's go and move our blue base over here. We got to move our blue bed over here. And we got a red one right there. So let's move our blue one here and we're going to match the spot like that. And we got to move our bridge down. We'll move all the bridges down because I think it looks better. All right, that looks good. So there's blue spawn. And I think what I'll do is I don't like the look of this because it looks so classic Roblox. Well, let's go and remove the decal on this and then I'm going to make it transparent. So this has a decal on it. Let's get rid of that and let's make it transparent there and let's do the same for the red one real quick get rid of the decal and then we're gonna make it transparent there we go this is the red spawn and we're gonna move that over here to the red base there we go all right we can get rid of these extras too we'll just go and delete these extra spawns because we only need one we only need one for each color there's the other blue one and get rid of that so now i think we need to test this let's see if it works i don't think there's much else we can do right now so let's go and test it hit play let's see what happens oh no my bridges my bridges are falling. No, they're falling apart. I bet it's because they don't have like terrain now that you just straight up fall, dude. Look at it's earthquake. I can't, I just want to see if the bed works. I'm going to fall, dude. That's dangerous. Let's go over here and see. Oh man, there's parts everywhere. It's like a tornado hit. Look at this. Oh man, I can't even test it. All right, let's go and anchor all these. Let's go and try it out. We got to test it out. Dude, it's totally bed wars. Look at it. It's hilarious. At least our bridges aren't falling now. See, I don't think these can be destroyed now, though. I kind of like that they're anchored. That way we still have a path because somebody's going to troll. They're just going to destroy everything. So this one still can be destroyed. I think I just didn't anchor this one, but I anchored the others. Oh, no, I got to go around. Okay, this is a 30 minute project. Okay, I, I don't I, we're not we're not spending hours on this game. It's 30 minutes. We just used a toolkit. All right. You're seeing it in the making. No filter. All right. Let's get this bed. Let's get the. It's mine. It's mine. It's my bed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's my bed. Mine. You know, let's speed up the run speed because it's taking forever. We got to speed this up. There we go. It's right there. Where's my run speed? Walk speed. 16. Let's go make it 30. Yeah, let's do 30. Yeah, that's way better. Yes. You cannot catch me. It looks like I have a stick in my hand. Like it's attached to a stick, but it's my bazooka. All right, here we go. Here we go. Captured. We, we got a point. We got a point. It worked. All right, so we got this big giant logo. It looks cool. Should we duplicate it? Wait a second. I have an idea. Let's put Snick Tricks in. Let's put a giant Snick Tricks. Yeah, dude, this is gonna look sweet. There we go. Check it out. Nice. Dude, we're gonna make him a giant. It's like Attack on Titan quality. Imagine he eats you. No, we're not gonna do that. Don't worry. That's future game. That's the next project we're gonna do. Snick Tricks eats all players. Survive Snick Tricks. You have to run away from him or eat you. Yeah, why don't we do that? We can do a Snick Tricks survival game. So the other thing is cool. They have like all these other items and stuff. Like look at Bedwars armor. They have kits. They've got all kinds of stuff. Ooh, look at it. it's a lucky airdrop. Wait, it's got a script. We gotta be careful with these. Let's get rid of all these scripts. There's scripts in here. Look at it. there's scripts in here. We gotta get rid of these. We don't need the scripts. We just want the visuals. We don't need any functionality. The fact that it says like ungroup stuff and like set it up on your server. <laughs> Someone's been working 
working hard. So we're gonna make these look like they're legit falling just for looks and visuals, because it looks cool. I like the purples, it's neat. I'm, I'm not even a big fan of purple, but it looks good in this game. Let's see what else is in here inside these. Looks like a bunch of airdrop. What the heck is that? Why are there humanoids in here? That's weird. We got the center here. That looks good. Look at Snick Tricks back there. <laughs> All right, look, we got, a, we got a pack of armor too. We could put this at the shop. What if I just take the Rage Blade and make it part of the island? Let's just go ahead and take the Rage Blade out. Because of course, Rage Blade, we love Rage Blades. We're gonna totally put it in place of the tree because Rage Blade, of course, of course, Rage Blade. I mean, it's so cool. Why wouldn't we put a Rage Blade in the center of our map? And we could do these things. We're not limited to, you know, Bed Wars blocks. No, we can put whatever we want in here. Let's go. You know, let's make it like a frost blade too. Instead of rage, it's like cold blade. It's like anti-temper. It's like calm blade. It's going to be cool blade because you're cool. Let's make it like dark blue or something instead. Like maybe this one. There we go. It's not really a dark blue, but it's good. And then let's make this like a bright, like icy. Yeah, that, that, that looks good. That works. I think the only thing we're missing is maybe flags. And what if we change these to like, what if we change these to white? Let's change all the, we'll change all the bridges to white. So they look kind of snowy. Looks more a part of the world. Like these brown bridges were just bugging me. That looks way better. Nice. That looks great. Okay. Now one thing we got to do, we got to add some flags. I think, I think the game needs flags because I'm so tired of like trying to figure out what base is what. I mean, it shouldn't be too bad with two bases, but man, the number of times I've gotten lost, like where's blue, where's red, where's purple. It'd be nice if the game had flags. So let's put some flags in here. There we go. There's the pole. We're going to go and move that a little bit. Now we got to do a flag. There we go. That works. And let's just make it the same blue as our bed. There's the bed color. There's the blue. All right, now we just need to center that real quick. And then we're gonna duplicate that. We're gonna put a red one on the other side. There we go. This one's for red base and let's make it red. So now I think it's ready for publishing. Let's go and get some players in. Nice, look at it, it looks so cool. So we're actually in the live game. Now I do have a restricted to friends because I don't want like, you know, to get in trouble with the devs really. I don't really don't want to get banned, okay? I, I did ask for permission. So if they do grant permission for me to publish this for a few days, I'll let you know in my community posts. So just make sure you turn on notifications so you don't miss it. Oh, dude, Finland just killed me, dude. But yeah, just keep an eye on the community section. Dude, he's totally hacking. He's he, he that was that was like aimbot. But yeah, keep an eye out in case they do get permission. I'll give you I'll give you a chance to play this. I currently, like I said, I only have it open to friends. Rage Blade looks so good. Oh, that was a head on. Did you see that head on collision? He jumped right into the rocket. He did. He did. Let's try to get his bed. We need to get his bed. Oh, he's gonna die. He's gonna die. He's out. He's out. Oh, he got he got cat. Nah, I got him. I got him. I'm gonna get him. He's right there. He's right in this corner. Boom, got him. Easy, easy. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Oh, you just got me again, dude. Come on. Come on, man. Let me get, let me just test getting your bed. Yeah. So let me, let me, Finland, just let me test getting your bed. This is just for debug purposes. Truly, truly for debug purposes. We're just going to test the game a little bit. Let's beta test. Let me just take your bed for a moment. I just want to make sure it works. He says, okay. Oh, he believes me. By now he should not believe me. Oh, I just killed him. He done. It's just a weird, this game just feels so wrong because we got rocket launchers and bed wars and beds and capture flag. You can actually capture beds. It's a totally different feeling when you you know you can't just like pearl in. Plus this game has no balloons, you know, already a little bit better, already a little bit better than the main game. I'm kidding. I'm kidding devs, don't hate me. Let me get your bed. Ah, oh, yeah, 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 I got his bed, I got his bed. We're running, we're running. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, oh, let's go. Yeah, later dude, get wrecked, get wrecked. Yep, later. Wait, how did I just fall through? <laughs> what? My bed. I just fell through. No, dude. Oh, the bed's gone. The bed's gone. Oh, no. Is it going to return? It's not respawning? Oh, no. Is it stuck in the void? Oh, it says flag returned. No, it's back. It's back. Oh, we're good. I think it's back. Ah, uh, we just tied. So I need to I need to make run speed faster. We're going to make run speed faster. All right, we got... We, I just increased the speed. Let's go. I just increased the run speed. Let's see how... Oh, dude, it's so much lag here. Look how fast we can go, though. Let's go. <laughs> Dude, it's so lagged. I don't even know what to do, but man, I just, I just got him. I got him. I got him. <laughs> He's all ran through the bed. Yeah, because it's lagged. I don't know what to say. Mad respect for the Bed Wars devs for making way better networking. Considering this game is so basic, imagine how much they have to do. I mean, this is crazy lagged and it's so basic. Anyway, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will let you know if the devs do give a thumbs up for me temporarily opening this up to everyone here so they can check it out for a few days. Because again, I just did this for memes. So we'll see. Anyway, thanks again. And I'll see you next time. Peace.